This is a brief demonstration of the process faculty can follow to download a grade report from their courses in Blackboard. So in your course in Blackboard, you'll go to your course's Full Grade Center. And in the Full Grade Center, once you've got grades assigned to students and you want to create a report, you can go to the Reports menu and go to Create Report. On this screen, you can give this report a name. And then you can choose what options you want to include in your report. So let's say I want to include the date, the course, and I'll run this for all students. I do have the option if I wanted to run this for individual students to, to capture an individual report. But for this example, I'll just choose all, all users. I can choose to include their username, student ID, and last access dates. I can choose to select what columns are included in the report. So I'm just going to choose everything that I have right now columns currently displayed in the grid, but you, you can choose which columns if you wanted to. And then you can also include additional information like due dates and run some statistics. You could get an average and display that average next to the student's individual score for each item. Okay, once you have customized the report, you can click Submit, and in a new window, the report will be generated. So in this example, you'll see here's a report for Annie asterisks, and then here are all her assessments and her scores. I can see here's the grades, just as it, I had entered them in, in Blackboard. I see a column for their due dates, if there's due dates associated with the assessments. And then a comparison, here's her grade, and then here is the course average grade, like so. And from here, you can either print this, from your browser or save this as a PDF. Most browsers when you print you can push Control P on your screen and you can choose how you want this to be printed. So if you wanted to have a hard copy printed to paper you would select your printer but if you wanted this to be um, something that you wanted to be saved to a PDF you could choose a PDF printer if you have one set up on your computer like so. Okay, so once you do that, here, I'll just choose this PDF, I'll click print, and the PDF will be generated, like so. So this is valuable for your records in addition to an Excel download. So here is an individual report for each individual student on a separate page. Okay, that's all there is to it.